The Land Rover Defender is a tool of conservation. Rwanda's the perfect place to test the new Defender simply because it's got incredible diversity of terrain. Tusk's partnership with Land Rover goes back over 15 years. Tusk is an African wildlife conservation charity. We want to use this year to really highlight the plight of the lion. We are now in a situation where we've got less lion in the wild than we have rhino. And I think that is a pretty shocking indictment. As a Kenyan myself, I had no idea until I started working here. Um, but we've only got 20,000 lion left in the world. It's crazy. The lion is actually Kenya's um, national animal, so it's intertwined with us as a people. On Barana, we have a team that's dedicated to tracking and monitoring lions, and they have to be able to go where the lions go and make sure that they're safe. The process of tracking and monitoring lions involves fitting of GSM devices, which we normally call collars, which are able to tell you where the animal goes and what it is doing. When it comes to collaring lion or tracking lion at any point, they're, they're hardly ever on the road. So that means that we need a vehicle that's capable of going off-road in quite an adventurous situation. It involves moving in with a full veterinary team. This team will use a tranquilizer dart and the animal will be out for around 40 minutes to maximum one hour. While we're in there, we take a lot of interesting measurements and a few blood samples and things just to keep up on the lion's general health. And now you have this data which will help you better manage the animal. The new Defender has demonstrated its skills in every environment that Mother Earth can throw at a vehicle. When you see lion cubs and know that you know, we have new lions in the landscape, you know, I can see that I'm making a difference. Big cuts are the epitome of all the cuts in that line of evolution. They are magnificent, they are beautiful, they are wonderful to be with. Us, as a human race, should make every opportunity for future generations to enjoy the same spectacle of nature we are so privileged to witness and observe.